Before the opening, Bell U.S. Indices closed mixed on Wednesday. Shares in semiconductors and semiconductor equipment, tech hardware and equipment and energy sectors traded higher, while shares in utilities, real estate and household and personal products, those sectors traded lower. On the economic docket, durable goods orders decreasing by 1.3 percent month over month in May. Also, wholesale inventories increasing by 0.4 percent month over month in May. This all as decliners ahead of advancers. Now, after the markets closed, Boeing. Regarding the Boeing 737 MAX issue, the U.S. FAA said it recently found a potential risk that Boeing must mitigate before it gets rid of the ban. Meanwhile, Asian markets were up today. The Nikkei rising 1.19 percent. The Hang Seng rising 1.42 percent. China CSI 300 up 1.07 percent. South Korea's Kospi up 0.59 percent. European markets still consolidating and U.S. futures call for a mixed start. Now, in terms of expectations today, Accenture, Walgreens Boot Alliance, McCormick, Conagra Foods and Nike all scheduled for release. Well, on the economic dock at 8.30 in the morning, we have first quarter core PCE prices quarter over quarter. We also have first quarter GDP. GDP growth rate figures and continuing and initial jobless claims numbers. 10 o'clock in the morning, we have pending home sales figures out and the EIA natural gas stocks change numbers. Now, taking a look at the markets, the S&P 500 is where we begin. That's turning up and in focus as the relative strength index advocates a further advance. Long positions above 29.1450 are favored with targets at 29.38 and 29.51 in extension. The Nasdaq, meanwhile, that's turning up with the Dow Jones turning up as well.